Wrestling fans, welcome back to another great week of professional wrestling. This week, you will see in action, Jive and Jimmy and Roadblock. Then, Miss Mercedes takes on Sheik Ali. And then, our main event, a six-man tag. You have on one side, Apollo, Matt Taven, and Julian Starr. They will be facing Chico, Ryan Fury, and the NWA On Fire Heavyweight Champion, Bobby Robinson. Next, you will see in action Jive and Jimmy as he takes on Roadblock. Wrestling fans, you want some good music? Then you want KGEL. How do you get the good music from KGEL? You visit their website or nwaonfire.com. Here we go again. I'm Tommy Savoldi with my co-host, Tommy Hunter. Tommy Savoldi, always, always a pleasure to be here with you, sir. And Tommy, look at what we have in the ring. Uh, Jive and Jimmy, boy, for a guy that size. I tell you, he's got a lot of rhythm, doesn't he? Does he ever stop moving? I don't know. He, You know, that's got to be jelly, because I've never seen Jim Jam shake, shake like that. that. You know that's right. <laughs> On the other side of the ring, there you see Mr. Road. Block. And he's built just like a road. You know what he reminds me of? You know those cement dividers that you see on a highway when you're going down a highway? Yeah. He reminds me of those. He <laughs> does. He's built like a roadblock. That's well, he's, exactly what he's built like. He's not green. He's not made out of concrete, though. Oh, well, I don't know about that. He looks a little <laughs> hard to me. And then we got our Frenchie. <laughs> the referee and calls the for ref- the bell. NWA ref, Frenchie Le Pew. There he is. <laughs> is that his last name? Really? Uh, Seriously? No, not really. I'm L-E-P-E-W? Just, just pulling look his at, string. Look at Jive and Jimmy. He's thinking he's like uh, like Adonis over here. Yeah. And here he goes. Here goes Roadblock with his version of the Adonis pose. Oh. I, don't think, I don't think either of them anything to oh, brag look at about. This. Look at this. Pearl Harbor now. Jimmy ain't taking it. Jimmy kicking to the back right now. Now he's making fun of the whole Adonis pose down. Uh-huh. Look at Roadblock. Boom! What a shot to the chops that was, boy. Off the rope comes Roadblock. Cross the ring. No, he misses. under. And, wow, oh. he hits. He hits Jav and Jimmy with a clothesline. Comes back of one of his own. What wow, another one? clothesline. He's telling him to get up. Whoa, no way. He's not going to pick him no, up. No, no, no way. No, 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 that ain't going to work, Roadblock. You need, a, you need a forklift to pick him up. Forklift. I think maybe a crane would do it. <laughs> big, big elbow now to the back of the head. Now he's got a kind of a chin lock, I guess you'd say, right now. Yeah, pushing on that chin. Trying to trying to take that head off, I think. It looks like he's trying to twist it off. That's not a twist off bottle cap. No, sure. <laughs> oh, crazy. uses that weight though. Comes all the way down to the back of Roadblock, sending him down to the canvas. What what's Jav and Jimmy doing? Making believe he's a seal? I don't know. I don't. Oh, know. again. I tell you what, though, for a man his size, he can definitely move pretty well. He reminds me a lot of the way he moves, like Dusty Rhodes. Uh huh. Well, I don't know if I put him in that category. I'm not, but I'm saying he's got a lot of the same <laughs> moves that. though. Like he does all the rhyming. And I, oh, look at the corner now. Referee getting him out there. Get, referee's got him with the five count. He knows he's got that five count. He can use every last second hey, that he can. He won't break it till four and three quarters. Referee backing him up now. Frenchie backing him up. I don't think he really cares what Frenchie says. What about you, no, Tommy? No, he really doesn't. In the corner now. What's he going to do with him? Irish whip in into the, the other corner. It looks like he Look set himself up for something. With the pose. He's got something up his sleeve. Uh-oh, the train's about to come into the station, I think. Oh! Oh, he missed! You see that little hop? Yes, I did. Oh, and here he is. One, two. Two, no, only a two count. Very close. Roadblock almost had him on that one. Sucked him in on that, didn't he? Fans, don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. Back again, T, and the action has not stopped one iota, and off the rope comes Roadblock. Oh! Jimmy misses, though. Whoa, with a nice shoulder block, though, on Roadblock. Second part. time he caught Jimmy on that one, boy. Whoa, another shoulder block. Wow, he loves those, doesn't he? He just plows in, boy. Look. He, well, when you're size He's trying it. again. Oh, no, what are you doing? You're never going to get him up. You know, if at first you don't succeed, don't try it again. Seriously. That's my motto. Seriously. Especially when it's, the guy is like about 100 pounds look heavier at, than look you. Look at Jive and Jimmy. All right there, Dusty. Get back to wrestling. <laughs> oh, big kick now right to the face. 
I have to say, Tommy, you are right about Roadblock. He is one big, just solid. He's a little fire plug, but, man, he just brings all of it to you, though, doesn't he? There's no finesse to his wrestling. He just plows and plows and plows. Whoa, snap, mares him over. There's no rhyme or reason the way he gets in there. He gets in there, and all he does is just keep going at it, boy. And cover, very slow to cover, though. One and two and no. I got to say, Tommy, for a guy that moves as well as Jivin' Jimmy does, he really takes his time in that ring, doesn't he? Yeah, he does. He, has, he, he works methodically. He knows what he's doing. He's a ring smart. He's been around for a few years, Tommy. Yeah, well, he's going to go up, I think, to the second. I don't know if this is the, the greatest move in the world. <laughs> I don't like know if this is going to work. <laughs> oh, boy, Jimmy, Jimmy, I think you is going up a little bit too high. Oh, no. Crotched him on that turnbuckle now. Now Roadblock just picking his shots now. Taking shot to shot. What's what's Roadblock going to do now? He caught Jimmy hanging out the dry. Oh, punch backs up, Mr. Roadblock. What's Javin Jimmy going to do? Looks like he wants to come off that middle rope now. Oh, boy. Possibly. No, oh, off the top look rope. At this. I think he hurt himself worse than he hurt Roadblock. Look at it. He knocked himself out. I believe you're right, Tommy Savoldi. Oh, he came down awkwardly on that one, boy. I knew that wasn't going to work, T. I just knew it. Frenchie putting the count on both of them. They're brought in a world of hurt right now. You know, when those, when those moves work fine, they, they're beautiful to see. But when they go bad, they go bad big time. Blocks a punch, though, and comes back with a punch of his own. Open fist, I believe. Maybe not. Off the rope. And hits him with another clothesline. He is so good with those clotheslines. My goodness, doesn't he have a tremendous clothesline? Look at this. Why? Oh, he, he did it. Oh, my God. He got him up off his feet. Two and whoa. Oh, no. Tommy, I would have bet you 10 bucks he would have never been able to do that. He did it. And you see, when he when he did it, he just <laughs> fell right on top of him and, for and the I, pin. And, and he was picking up 300-plus dead weight there. I wow. That. And that football stance now. And he hits him. Linebacker from way back gets on top. Can't even get that leg up, that huge tree trunk. Only a two count. Only a two. He can't believe it. He so he thought he should have had three on that uh, one. Frenchie's letting him know it's two. Let me tell you. You're never gonna get, get don't anywhere. Argue or, with the yeah, ref, I was brother. just gonna say, Tommy. Don't argue with the ref. You're never gonna get anywhere doing it. Here he goes again. Wants to do it again. No, but he misses and he hits that leg. Oh goodness, goodness. Went to the well one too many times. The old saying goes. That's right. Javin Jimmy now closed fist right to the head. What a shot that was. I felt that here. I felt the vibration where I'm sitting. Whoa, sick. big kick. Javin Jimmy in well control now. Whoa, big splash on top. Oh, my goodness. One, two, that three. Did it. That's it. You ain't getting up from that. I, I wouldn't be getting up from that. No, but I'll tell you what, he did put up a heck of a fight. He certainly did. Oof, get the spatula to, to clean up roadblock. My goodness. Well, chalk up a win for... Look, there goes Jimmy. There he goes. He loves that disco music. Oh, yeah. Some people say disco is dead, but Javin Jimmy would, would <laughs> argue with that. No, he's going to argue with you on that one. He hears disco music in his head 24-7. I got news for you. Does he have the disco ball there, too? Absolutely. Okay. Oh, what's, what's he, he doing? doing now? Oh, he's not had enough. Oh, he's go giving another shot to Roadblock. He wants to show him you really lost this match. Oh, Come now on. he's choking him. Come, Come on, on Frenchie. Frenchie. Break that up. Blatant chokehold. The match is over. Ref, get in there. Stop this. Oh, with both heads now. Choking it. Choking the life out of Roadblock. Come on, Frenchie. you got to get physical with something like that. you got to break he's that. He's putting a count on him. Wait. This? Chef that? Baker. Whoa, Chef Baker with that spatula. With that whisk, I mean. Look at that whisk. Look at the size of that thing. He Unbelievable. Just, whoa, over and over again on Jivin Jimmy. Chef Baker taking on the Jivin one. Look at the size of that whisk. <laughs> Because you got a lot of fight and a lot of...
o'clock, and you're going to be one of our biggest stars. I want you to know that. You think I'm not This is Bob Kahn, the con man from NWA on Fire. Listen, fans, if you want to get involved, you want to host a fundraiser free of charge, not a dime out of your pocket, all you have to do is go to nwaonfire.com, click on the email link, nwaonfire at aol.com. It doesn't cost you a dime. You can get involved, make some money for your organization. Get involved, have some fun, make some cash. There we go, folks, and I'll tell you what, this is going to be a special match. This is something you don't see every day. Miss Mercedes, a newcomer to NWA on fire, challenge Sheik Ali. It's going to be a special mixed match. And uh, you can tell by uh, his headdress that he's going to be just such a popular character here. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. And I'll tell you, you look at this little girl, you look at this Miss Mercedes, and you say to yourself, no way. But I'll tell you what, folks, you're in for a big treat. You're in for a big treat. Miss Mercedes coming up the ranks here to end NWA on fire, and she'll take on all comers. Hey, not afraid of anybody. You know, that's like most of the women with NWA on fire. They're tough. They're tough, and I'll tell you what, they will not shy down for male or female. And there she is, Miss Mercedes. Oh, Popular yeah. here, obviously. Tell me, how come you're not out there getting a hug from her? I tell you what. I should be, shouldn't I? You should be. I don't, I don't know what you're doing here with me right now. Absolutely. She yeah. is a cute little girl. I'll tell you that right now. Making some fans here in the audience, obviously. Well, I want to see how she's going to hold herself against someone like Sheik Ali. Well, Sheik Ali is a pretty nasty guy. He, yeah. He's not exactly uh, the kind of guy you bring home for Thanksgiving dinner and introduce him to your mom. Maybe for Ramadan. Absolutely. Did you get that? Did you get what I meant by that? I got what you meant okay. by that. Okay, I'm just Absolutely. checking. Because uh, sometimes Tommy... I just don't want to push it any farther than that. Because <laughs> sometimes Tommy, I know someone comes, go whoop, right over the head. No, no, I got it, brother. <laughs> well, as you were saying, Tommy, before Sheikh Ali, he will bend, shall we say, bend every rule that he possibly can. So Miss Mercedes has definitely got to keep on her toes here. Oh yeah, oh yeah, and uh, you know. After all, I mean, let's put the, let's put it down on the table the way it really is. Go ahead. She's not a big girl. No. She's a kind of petite. But it's she all, can move, though. You know, she can move, and she has ring skills, and she is relying on her speed and her ring smarts. Absolutely. And you know what? I'm going to give her a 50-50 shot on this. I think she can pull it off. I think she just blew a kiss to you, Tommy. Yeah. Or was that me? I, I couldn't I tell. I don't know. Yeah, I'm trying to figure that one out. And there's the bell from Frenchie. And whoa! Oh, drop toe hold from Miss Mercedes on Sheik Ali. Sheik Ali. Oh, look at that little girl fly. Ref out of position. Only a one count. Sheik Ali's not really should hit him there. Low drop, drop kick. kick. Right to the midsection. I was thinking that was a little south of the midsection. Oh, yeah. Miss Mercedes on top now. Going for that pin. Wants to end this quick. I tell you, she's not wasting any time, is she? Absolutely not, Tommy Savoldi. Fans, just wanted to bring you up to date. If you want to get all of our latest updates and what's going on Look in NWA on Fire, whoa! Look at that move! Just go to www.nwaonfire.com, bring you up to date with everything. Sheik Ali now posing to the crowd a little bit. He really should be on top of Miss Mercedes. He thinks he's got this match well in hand right now, 